Well, we're less than 48 hours away from the start of St. Patrick's Day and Western Washington, of course, is getting ready in a big way. Photojournalist Dustin Gagne was there as the patron saint himself sailed into Seattle. Hey, well, I am Captain Kidd, and this here be Davy Jones. Davy Jones! There you go. Bye. St. Patrick's a 1,500-year-old saint, and he comes back to the Emerald City traditionally every year, along with the Lord Mayor of Galway. I'm Mike McQuaid. I'm with the South Lake Union Community Council and a member of the South Lake Union Chamber. And we're playing an active role in welcoming Irish Week to the city of Seattle and particularly welcoming back St. Patrick to the Emerald City. We're here to protect the Emerald City of Seattle. But every once in a while, yes, every once in a while, we do let those from the Emerald Isle come aboard, land here. Where is? St. Patrick, who lived during the 5th century, is known as the patron saint of Ireland and... Whereas at the age of about 16, St. Patrick first came to Ireland after being captured from his home in Great Britain and taken as a slave by Irish pirates. I think everybody is Irish on St. Patrick's Day and this is an opportunity really to celebrate everything that's great in Ireland, every, everything that's great about Irish Americans and really celebrate the diversity in Seattle and the state of Washington. It's nice to be back in Seattle. <laughs> So St. Patrick is here, and we're going to have one heck of a time here today. Aye. Oh, <laughs> lots of drinking, lots of fooling around, lots of fun. Happy St. Patrick's Day to Seattle and the Emerald City. Hey, what do they say? Erin hey. Gobra! Erin Gobra! <laughs> 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 